Hello everyone, myself Naveen. Me and my teammate Dinesh, we are here today to give the presentation on the topic Unemployment Data Analysis using Python. As we all know, unemployment is one of the major problems the world is facing today. According to the statistics, there are around 68 million young people across the world who are unemployed. This problem is increased a lot in the recent times and there are even many reasons for this. Most of the companies are focusing on restructuring their organization and employees. As a result, there are n number of layoffs. And even we are aware that if this issue is not dealt in a proper way with firm hand and right direction, then it will affect the youth a lot. They will be facing very hard times which impacts their future. And my teammate Dinesh will take over the presentation from here. Hi everyone, this is Dinesh. Further moving into the issue, according to a report submitted by International Labour Organization, the global youth unemployment rate is 13.6%. There are approximately 1.3 billion young people across the globe between ages 15 to 24. Around 497 million young people are into labour force. Out of these, 429 million are employed and other 68 million are looking for work. More than half of young people, around 776 million, are outside labor force, meaning they are pursuing an education. Alongside their studies, they may be employed and some of them may be looking for part-time. On a broad scale, 267 million, a high figure of young people, are not into employment or education or into training. Graph here shows the unemployment rate of the world as well as the comparison among various sub-regions in the year 2019. The main objective of this project is to show how various countries are affected due to unemployment. This analysis takes the issue into big picture and brings the contrast between various groups of countries. These are the technical requirements used in this project, web scraping. We will be extracting the unemployment data from various websites. The extracted data sets will be cleaned and prepared in such a way that it is ready for data analysis. Exploratory data analysis will be made on this data in order to find the unforeseen patterns in the data. At last, the findings will be communicated using data visualization. Thank you everyone.